Hey guys, so <clears throat> in this video, I'm going to go ahead and do my review video on My Little Pony Season 6, Episode 24, Top Bolt. Alright, and I, yes, I indeed am doing this video early uh, before this Saturday, and the reason why is, is because this episode got leaked. <laughs> so yeah, so that's kind of why I'm doing it early. But anyway, so in this episode, it first starts off with Artie in the Wonderbolts locker room packing up to, to go um, after spring training. So my guess is that probably took a while. And Artie finally got done with it, and now she's really looking forward to spending time with her friends. So after Artie flies out of Cloudsdale, uh, her cutie mark actually started to glow, telling her that she has a friendship mission to do, and and her friendship mi mission actually takes place in Cloudsdale when she found that out, and, and this time she is doing her friendship mission with Twilight. And so in the next, so after the, uh, the, after the intro, Twilight and Artie arrived at Cloudsdale, and that's where you, and that's where you got, get the chance to see Spitfire with some uh, students at the Wonderbolts Academy, which made me, which kind of made me think back to that episode in season three, the Wonderbolts Academy, with, where she ended up, uh, I think it was Lightning Dust. She ended up having to work with her, but things didn't go out well in that episode. But anyway, and then some of the students, once Artie and Twilight arrived, some of the students were amazed to see Artie again. And <laughs> during this review, I just, I just now remembered Lightning Dust. I mean, it's been so long since I've seen her that that pony. But <laughs> anyway, so after Spitfire told her students to just to do some laps. They had asked Spat, Sp, Spitfire about a friendship issue and tried to see if they had if if Spitfire knew of one that 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 Twilight Nardi had to take care of. But she but apparently they didn't get anything from Spitfire. However, Ardy and Twilight did need to help needed to help them with some help some of the students on how to improve. So then Twilight and Ardy meet up with the students in a classroom room in Cloudsdale to help them out. And that's where they actually meet a couple where you we get a chance to meet a couple of new ponies. One is named Sky Stinger and one is named Vapor Tail. And I thought those were pretty cool names for those ponies. However, uh Sky Sky Stinger seemed a little cocky and arrogant about it uh, though about about how he about how he does he wants to do how well he wants to do so after that class, Twilight, that went pretty well, but, but some parts of it, it was kind of, already ended up falling asleep through it, though. <laughs> but then S Sky Stinger had to talk to Twilight and Artie. He, he, he told them that he was worried about the Sola test, but he, he also said he was worried about Vapor. So in the next scene, uh, S Sky and Vapor showed off their showed off their flying skills. Twilight was actually impressed at Sky Stinger's flying skills. However, Artie noticed that Vapor note noticed that Vapor um that her that her wing one thing that Artie didn't notice was that that under that her wing was under hit his and thought she she was trying to give him like a boost. So that's where uh, Twilight and Artie found out what their friendship problem was, which was to help Vapor and Sky with their flying situation. However, Artie and Twilight were deciding if they should tell if they should tell tell him about their flying situation. And so, in the next scene, Twilight and Artie met up with uh with Vapor in the locker room, even though Artie was trying to be supportive to her. Twilight was trying to get out the truth to Vapor about her flying skills, or both Vapor and and uh, and Sky. So, but then Artie had told Vapor that's going to be pretty obvious during the uh, solo trials when when he can't get enough air to do a, a flipping loop. However, sorry. 
sorry for the yawn. <laughs> but anyway, however, so yeah, they told her about the loop. However, that got Vapor concerned about Sky, and that's where Vapor Vapor gave a little backstory of a uh, Sky Stinger and Vapor when they were little. So Sky Stinger had a has a lot of siblings, and it showed him spending time with them. It was kind of tough for him though, trying to get attention from his parents since he had a lot of since he's got a lot of siblings. However, Vapor Trail hated the attention she got from her parents despite being a, uh, a an only child. And I must say, Vapor is in a way a little like Fluttershy for some reason. Just because of the like the soft, quiet, and somewhat timid voice that, that she has compared to Sky. And I must say, she did look cute though with, with that mane and the way she sounded though. But anyway, so however once Sky tried to impress his parents with his flying skills in that flashback, Vapor tried to help him a little bit with his flying. With with a little breeze, I think it came from uh, Vapor's wings. That's where her and Sky Stinger met. And it meant a lot to Vapor that they got a chance to fly together. And Vapor's friendship with Sky meant so much to her that R.D. and Twilight had to get her to tell Sky the truth. However, R.D. thought it. However, R.D. thought of a different technique to help him. So Twilight did some lecturing with Sky, while Vapor did some flying practice with R.D. But then Sky uh, did some flying practice with Twilight as well. So after flying practice. Vapor made a compliment about herself in trying to keep up. However, she had to tell Sky to practice. However, he kept getting caught. He still kept getting cocky about it and thinking otherwise. And that's where Vapor had to tell Sky he's not as good as he thinks he is. I love the face that Twilight made after she said that. But Sky still felt like he didn't need Vapor's help. However, when Sky did started flying again, it didn't turn out so good, and that ended up affecting Sky and Vapor's friendship because of how bad he felt about his flying skills and, and how he thought of Vapor as a winged pony. Just because, just because, I don't know, maybe they were both holding back on something. I think that was the case. But anyway, so in the next scene, that's where Twilight told Artie that they should have done things her way. However, R.D. thought otherwise, but then Spitfire noticed that Sky wasn't flying so well, and apparently Spitfire didn't take that too well. However, Twilight and R.D. did manage to fix things up with them and Sky and Vapor by convincing them to help each other out, and apparently that worked out. <laughs> so in the next scene, Twilight and, and R.D. helped Sky and Vapor train some more. So the next day, Sky and Vapor showed Spitfire their flying skills, and which then got them got them both into the Wonderbolt Academy. And so after Twilight and Artie helped out Sky and Vapor, their cutie marks started to glow, telling them that they're fresh fre that they completed their friendship mission. So overall, I thought this was a pretty good episode. It was nice to see R.D. and Twilight have a mission together. And it was nice to see, to meet some new ponies as well. And they did have some pretty cool names as well. And I think it was a good fresh friendship mission for R.D. and Twilight to do. So this, but anyway, so this is my review video on My Little Pony Season 6 Episode 24. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time, alright? Alright, thanks guys. Alright, bye.